Sportsman Show West of the Mississippi happens this week at the Portland Expo Center. And the Pacific Northwest Sportsman Show will run through Sunday. I will tell you who's very excited about this. My father-in-law. Yeah? Papa Dell. <laughs> Papa uh, the Dell. man <laughs> has attended most of the shows over the years and they're now in year 43. Wow. And I went yesterday just before they opened the doors to the public. Lines around the building. No kidding. On day one. Wow. Uh, so here we go with a little preview of this year's Sportsman Show. Get ready for the costume change. Hello there from inside the Portland Expo Center home this week to the 43rd annual Pacific Northwest Sportsman Show. It's back again with some of the favorites you expect to see here. The heads and horns competition. They've got not only the kids free trout pond, but the indoor steelhead river. You've got fishing boats, you've got campers, and yes, we will check out a little bit later this morning, the camp cooking area. But first, let me introduce you to the survival expert on hand this week at the Sportsman Show. He is Brett Stoffel. So Brett, I'm thinking we're outdoors. We need means of survival. Two things to keep in mind. You always want to be warm and you always want to be dry. Absolutely. Can you keep me warm? Show me a tip to keeping warm. You bet. So using things that you got around the house, cotton and Vaseline is one of the best ways to start a fire quickly and easily. Vaseline. Vaseline. Petroleum jelly is what they call that. So what I'm going to do is I've got one that I put together, regular old cotton ball and Vaseline. I'm okay. going to tear those two pieces apart and you can see there's a lot of thin little wispy dry cotton still inside. Sure. That's what I'm going to actually use. This is called a metal match. So I'm going to throw sparks at that dry cotton that I just exposed and it's going to start a fire. And you could literally, literally keep all that material in a pocket. I mean, it's that small. Absolutely. And that cotton ball like that will burn for almost 10 minutes. All right, so we're staying warm. Now I want to stay dry. What do you have for that? Absolutely. Another common item, big garbage bag. What are we going to do with this? Okay, so we're going to put this on and it's going to protect you we're going to wear from it. the environment. You're going to put it right on. That's right. Put it on me, Brett. <laughs> Can I ask you as you put it on? And I know this probably sounds great on my microphone. Why the color blue? The blue color does not occur naturally. So it stands out and it contrasts with every single environment on the planet. So it's a passive signal so people can find you much more easily if you're wearing this color. It is the Pacific Northwest Sportsman Show. It is happening today through Sunday at the Portland Expo Center. Yes, we are dry. Yes, we are warm. But yes, we're also hungry. So we're doing some camp cooking coming up next hour. I always knew you looked good in blue, but now you've proved a point. Full coverage. Uh, day two of the show yeah. opens today at 11 o'clock and it runs through Sunday. Cool. That's hilarious. Can't wait to see your next report.